All right, so we're going to cover the four major wave dynamic uh, mechanisms that we can use to help tune the induction system. And, and the first one is intake valve opening. So when the intake valve opens, we create a negative wave that shoots up to the planum and will flip polarity when it hits the planum, but I'll cover that as we go. Uh, the next wave is obviously exhaust induced scavenging. Uh, if we design our exhaust properly, especially if we incorporate steps, we'll create a negative wave. And, and this is ignoring the physics, so the actual mechanical mechanisms of induction tuning, so inertia supercharging and, and pressure drop. So when, when air rushes out of the exhaust port, it obviously creates a negative pressure in other cylinders and also all that weight of air rushing out creates a negative pressure at the back of the valve. But then we have the actual induction wave that's going to refract back into the cylinder if we get the timing right and if we get the stepped header right because the change or any change in um, diameter in the induction system will cause a reflection wave. Um, most will cause two waves, one that will throw off positive, one that will throw off negative, depending on where in the induction it is. So uh, there's there's quite a bit to it. 